to Module 7 of the Versa Essentials series. In the first few modules, we discussed how WAN technology has evolved over time and the way organizations have consumed WAN technology. We discussed challenges with traditional WAN and touched upon general SD-WAN principles and design guidelines that have helped address these challenges. In this module, we'll discuss one of the most versatile, secure SD-WAN products available in the market. We'll discuss the basic building blocks of the Versa SD-WAN solution and look at various components of the solution that are combined to deliver the best design, performance, and visibility for your network operations. Versa started its journey in the Virtualized Network Functions, or VNF, space. In 2012, when the company came into existence, development was focused on software-defined routing services and load balancers for use as virtualized CPEs. In 2014, Versa Networks began developing orchestration and analytical capabilities to complement the virtualized network functions. In 2015, Versa Networks introduced software-defined WAN combined with orchestration and analytical capabilities. Later, in 2016, Versa Networks integrated next-generation firewall and unified threat management capabilities to the overall solution. In 2017, Versa Networks integrated LTE, Wi-Fi, PPPoE, and Universal CPE features into the SD-WAN offering. In 2018, Versa Networks introduced the self-service portal, mobile app provisioning, and cloud services Versa gateways. The solution consists of three main components, the Versa Director, a Versa Flex VNF, and Versa Analytics. All three components are independent software components developed by Versa Networks from the ground up. Versa Director. Versa Director is the orchestration engine. It owns provisioning, device onboarding, and operations and management. It is the component that makes the Versa solution software defined. End-to-end lifecycle management of branch CPE software is done through Versa Director. This is the one single orchestration plane for various networking services. Versa Director supports cloud connectors towards AWS, Azure, OpenStack, Versa, VMware, Flex, VNF, and others for automatic Flex instantiation VNF of is the software branches. component that sits at the customer's edge. The Director provides configurations to the Flex VNF nodes, which provide services to the end user. Versa Flex VNF is a single software image that delivers security, routing, SD-WAN, load balancing, CGNAT, and other services. Based on the configuration provided by Versa Director, the services are instantiated and delivered to customers. Networking services from Layer 2 to Layer 7 all through a single software Versa image, analytics. customers are not required Versa to have analytics multiple images the third for different component, types of which service. Which is the big data analytics engine. Once the solution is deployed and branches start operating, the analytics engine receives logs from the devices and saves them in a database. It provides visibility and correlation for network logs and events, which can be used for continuous improvement and to enhance the end user experience while having complete control over network operations. All of these components support true multi-tenancy, which provides economy of scale to large enterprises and service providers. Versa Director and Versa Analytics can communicate with third-party software over RESTful API for automation and can be easily integrated with a customer's infrastructure. All Versa solution components can be installed in a white box, gray box, or in a virtualized or cloud-based infrastructure. Each of the three software images, the Versa Director, Versa Analytics, and Flex VNF, can be used in any of these deployment types. The solution architecture is composed of three main functions, the Management Plane, the Control Plane, and the Data Plane. The Management Plane Versa Director is the owner of the management plane and functions as an SD-WAN orchestrator. Versa Director is responsible for managing the end-to-end -end lifestyle of the FlexVNF-powered branch devices. 
provisioning, device onboarding, operations, management, and device termination are all performed over the management plane by Versa Director. The Control Plane The control plane of the Versa architecture is responsible for discovering branches that participate in the SD-WAN, identifying the topology, building information to secure branch-to-branch -branch communication, and other control plane functions. Versa Controller is responsible for building the control plane intelligence with SD-WAN branches and for distributing reachability information throughout the SD-WAN domain. Versa Controller runs the Flex VNF software but with a different personality. It acts as a BGP route reflector and propagates control plane information across branch devices. Versa Controller is deployed along with Versa Director and Versa Analytics in the head-end infrastructure. The controller is exposed to the WAN transports and uses secure control connections with the branches. The data plane is the third part of the Versa architecture. The data plane passes production traffic between branches. The data plane doesn't involve the control plane or management plane components. The data plane consists of secure tunnels between branches to forward data. Every branch will have to go through a device onboarding procedure, which is also called the staging process. Versa supports various staging techniques, including URL ZTP, Global ZTP, and manual Python script-based provisioning. The device staging process happens over a secured IPsec channel between the branch and the controller in the head end. Once IC authentication is verified on the controller, the Versa controller notifies Versa Director that the branch is beginning the staging process. Versa Director establishes a netconf session with the branch over the secured staging tunnel and pushes the configuration to the device. Once the branch receives its configuration from Versa Director, the branch device reboots and joins the SD-WAN. Every SD-WAN branch will establish static IPsec tunnels to Versa Controller. The control plane protocol, which is multi-protocol BGP, is established over the IPsec tunnel. This creates the control plane of the solution where reachability and WAN topology information is shared. Once branches have received the SD-WAN reachability information from the controller, each branch establishes secure dynamic overlay tunnels to remote branches based on the topology information defined by the administrator. These dynamic tunnels are referred to as data paths and traffic between branch locations is forwarded over these secure tunnels. This is the end of session 7 of the Versa Essentials series. In this session we discussed the Versa Networks SD-WAN solution and Versa head-end components or the Versa Director, Versa Analytics, and Versa controller nodes. Thank you for your participation in this session and we hope you found the session informative.